Serious trouble looms in Nigeria. See terrible disaster that would befall Nigeria if this issue is not resolved. Hmm. Um, Nigeria is known for this anyway. It's not uh, a today issue. It has been an issue that has been on for years. You understand? This issue has been on for years. So one should not be surprised. You get it. So as it is right now, I will tell you that uh, Nigeria is experiencing this because of, of um, the challenges that the country is currently in as per leadership yes as per leadership so our leaders are the fault and and, and also they are the problem <laughs> Let, let's check the content this is today's news the people democratic party pdp stalwart olapode church has voiced concern over the potential descent into anarchy if faith in the Nigerian judiciary continues to erode. His apprehension stemmed from the recent discord surrounding the Court of Appeals ruling on the Kano State Governorship election. The appellate court's decision to nullify Governor Abba Yusuf election and declare Nasa Kawuna of the All Progressive Congress APC as the victor raised eyebrow. The situation became even more perplexing when the certified true copy of the judgment indicates an affirmation of Yusuf's election. The court later attributed this inconsistency to a clerical error adding a layer of complexity to an already contentious issue. Addressing this matter during a press conference in Lagos on Monday, George expressed deep disgust about the warning trust of Nigerians in the judiciary. You see, everything still centered on failed judiciary. Our judiciary is a failed one. We have a failed judiciary. The problem we are having in uh, when it comes to justice is from our judiciary. It's from our judiciary. You see that? So not until our judiciary begin to do what they feel that is right. I don't think um, anything right will ever be done or achieved in, the, in, uh, in this country. If the wrong leader is elected, for example, what do you think will happen to the nation? The nation will suffer. Like what we are see, what we are facing now, you can see the country is already suffering because of Tunubu coming into power and his and his policy that has just been introduced. <laughs> okay, oh, my people, I don't talk my own. I know I know if you talk more than that. Um, let me quickly hear from you on this and then um, let's know what your take and what your advice on what has just been revealed right now may be. It's a pleasure. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as play button to receive more updates. Thank you.